These clothing and shoe recycling bins, well, they look nice now, but that certainly wasn't the case earlier on. Wait until you see what happened after I got the city involved in the process. Marianne Friend loves to walk her dog in downtown Euclid, but walking by this clothing and shoe recycling bin near Mark's is not fun. This box hasn't been here that long, but since it's been here, it's just been a mess. I got a hold of these pictures from the bin from July 4th and then again July 18th. And today we found a suitcase full of trash, a box filled with Vaseline and skincare products, used hairbrushes, and most bizarre, foot soap. This is downtown Euclid, so it's not a good scene for our city. Across the street, I found another set of bins from a different company. Trash around them, too. As we searched neighboring cities, we found cleaner bins. When we came back to Euclid, the bin by Marks was cleaned up by this Quartz Community Service crew with the city of Euclid. I told them about the mess across the street, and they went right away. I called the recycling company responsible for the Marks bin. No one around, so I left a message. City crews tell me this is the second time this week that they've had to come by and pick up garbage that is surrounding your bin. I did get a hold of a supervisor for the other company. You're getting out of the clothing business. He says the bins are checked monthly, but people should call when they see a mess. After talking with the company, I was assured that these full bins will definitely be taken care of by tomorrow. I'm investigator Jonathan Walsh, News Channel 5.